What's going on everyone? In this video, we're going to be talking about how to transfer Uniswap V3 liquidity pool NFTs to other digital wallets such as the MetaMask wallet or the Coinbase digital wallet. So let's dive right into this video. I'm going to be explaining what is the Uniswap V3 liquidity pool NFTs, what they are, the, and the two different methods that we've discovered that allow you to transfer these NFTs to your other wallets. So I'll dive right in right now to what these NFTs actually are. So here's an example of the USDC slash WETH NFT on uh, OpenSea. You can see here we have um, the name of the NFT, USDC slash WETH. This is the percent fee, so it's at 0.3 percent. And this is the, the fees that you could uh, that are associated with the NFT or the liquidity pool. And each of these NFTs do represent a liquidity pool. So when you create a liquidity pool on Uniswap, the creator of the pool is issued an NFT. There are four different Different types of fee ranges that are you can use to create these pools. 0.3 is the the standard one, and this 0.3% represents this curve right here. Down here we have the ID of the NFT. So this is a, a crucial part of the NFT. You're going to need this ID to actually transfer these NFTs later in the video. And we have the minimum tick, the maximum tick. And you can see here some, this is the description of the NFT with the pool addresses, the WEATH addresses, the different token addresses. Another thing to note out here too is the token standard for these NFTs is ERC721 uh, on the Ethereum chain. So I'll show you next here. This is the NFT that we're actually going to be transferring. This is right from Uniswap. This uh, liquidity pool is closed, but you can transfer both open and closed liquidity pools using uh, this method. And so the ne next thing too I should show you, I, that I should tell you about is when trying to transfer these NFTs, say you have your NFT in, in your MetaMask wallet, right? Uh, MetaMask does not support the ability to transfer NFTs right now, or specifically these type of types of NFTs and neither does OpenSea. Uh, when trying to transfer these NFTs on OpenSea, I'll show you right now too. Uh, if you go to OpenSea and connect your digital wallet, uh, come to collected uh, in your profile and then click transfer on this NFT, click continue. You can see, boom, we get hit with a 404 error. So OpenSea doesn't support the ability to transfer these NFTs. MetaMask too, when you try to do this on MetaMask mobile, uh, your app crashes, then the MetaMask extension right now on your browser, your Chrome browser, doesn't offer the capability to transfer these NFTs either. So we, what we've done is we actually reached out to the Uniswap developer team, we've contacted them, and they showed us the, the two recommended methods in order to transfer these NFTs. So I'll dive into that right now. So the next thing we're going to want to do here, this is my um, wallet address. So we're going to want to go to, let's see, down here, we can go to my wallet, scroll down to ERC721 tokens. You can see here, if you created a pool, this should be in your wallet. Go to Etherscan. IO, type in your wallet address, and then scroll down under the tokens and select this uh, NFT or the ERC721 token. So we're going to click this, and this is going to take you to your Uniswap V3 positions, your liquidity pool NFT and Uniswap. And the next thing we're going to want to do here is go to contract. So I'm going to click contract, and then I'm going to click write contract, and then I'm going to want to connect my digital wallet. In this case, I'm going to be connecting my MetaMask wallet. So I'm going to click right here, connect to Web3, and click OK. And then I'm going to connect my MetaMask wallet. And I should tell you too, guys, I'm going to have links to the description below talking about everything. I'll have a, include an article going into more detail explaining what these uh, NFTs are, how they work. I'll throw a link too to, um, to this. Uh, website here, the Etherscan um, contract address and how to write the contract and transfer, as well as the other method too that I'll get into a second, the Uniswap V3 helper that uh, I'm actually going to be using and how to transfer these NFTs. I'll have links to the description for everything. So, but yeah, jumping back to this, we're on the Uniswap V3 positions NFT token. You can find this um, either by going to the link in the description or going to your wallet, clicking your NFT. And then next thing we want to do is click contract, click write contract, connect to your digital wallet, and then scroll down to safe transfer step 11. So this is how we're going to safely transfer the, these NFTs to another digital wallet. And I should say too, some all digital wallets are not built the same. So some digital wallets don't actually support 
the token standard for these NFTs, the ERC721 tokens. Uh, the ones that I am 100% sure that do support these NFTs are uh, OpenSea and MetaMask. I believe Coinbase Digital it might support it well, but I'm 100% sure that MetaMask does. Uh, so with that out of the way, uh, I'll also to I'll touch on some of the documentation. This is directly from Uniswap. So I'll just cover the parameters here. I won't go into too much detail, but this is the safe transfer from. This is the function that we're going to be using. And the parameters here state that the token is the contract address of the token to be transferred. The from is the originating address from which the tokens will be transferred. The to is the destination address of the transfer. And then the value is the amount to be transferred. So with that out of the way, we're going to jump back over here to this number 11 safe transfer from function. Our from address is going to be my digital wallet MetaMask address right here. And we're going to want to be sending it to my other MetaMask wallet address here. And then the token ID, this is going to be the liquidity pool or the NFT ID. So if we go back here, we can see on the NFT right here, we have the ID right here. It's 327783. And this number, this token, I, the ID on the NFT matches up in the URL right here at the top. So I'm just going to copy this right out of the URL. And I'm going to paste it in right here. And then I'm going to write the contract, confirm it in my wallet. And then that will safely transfer my NFT from this address to this address. And so I'm not actually going to be doing it this way, though. I'm going to be using the Uniswap V3 helper application built by Crypto Rachel on the Uniswap developer team. So uh, this is going to be the very first link in the description below. I'm going to connect my wallet right now uh, and be connecting my MetaMask wallet. OK, I just connected my MetaMask wallet. I'm going to remove this information right here. And what's great about this is that I can just click this button, get NFT IDs. And boom, we have the NFT ID right here. I'll open this in a new tab. This is actually going to be the NFT that we're going to be transferring. And you can see here we have the NFT ID right here. And then the, the, these two numbers match up in the URL as well. So I'm just going to copy this again, this number, the NFT ID, paste it into NFT ID and then paste in the address that I'm going to want to transfer the token to, pasting it right here, and then I'm going to click transfer, and then I'm going to confirm this transfer on MetaMask, and boom, just like that, I should have safely, I would have safely transferred my MetaMask, or sorry, my Uniswap liquidity pool NFT to my other MetaMask wallet. And uh, a note to guys, ignore everything down here. This is a completely different uh, application. This will not close out your entire position. It will not remove the liquidity from your pool. Um, using this up here, you can also transfer both closed NFT, uh, uh, closed Uniswap liquidity pool NFTs as well as open liquidity pool NFTs. It doesn't matter, but this is how you safely transfer your NFT from one digital wallet to another. Um, if you guys have any questions about this, drop a comment below, like, subscribe, and um, if you need any additional support with any crypto services, if you've created your own token or you need help transferring your liquidity pool NFTs, send us an email at abyss.com slash contact. Our support team is happy to help you with this. Thank you so much, everyone. I appreciate your time.